And tonight, you can watch Seinfeld airing on our sister station, CW17. It will premiere at 11.30 this evening. And this morning, one of the guest actors on the series joins us. Larry Thomas played the hilariously stern, stone-faced character commonly known as the Soup Nazi. Excuse me, uh, I think you forgot my bread. Bread? Two dollars extra. Two dollars? But everyone in front of me got free bread. You want bread? Yes, please. Three dollars! <laughs> No soup for you. No soup for you. I, you know, I can watch that again and again, and I laugh every single time. Even after all of these years, Larry Thomas joins us via Zoom this morning. Thanks for being with us. Oh, my pleasure. So would you yes. give us a little backstory to that famous line? I mean, was it scripted? Yes, it, it, it was actually scripted, but there's one funny little thing. Uh, the night before the audition, uh, they didn't have anything on paper to supply me with. So while I was improvising the night before, a friend of mine who's a stand-up comedian called me and he said, improvise something for me right now. And I had already picked up the accent from Omar Sharif from Lawrence of Arabia. So I improvised this. I said, you, small fry, I don't like your look. You're bald. Get to the back of my line or you get no soup. And my friend said, that no soup thing is really funny. And then I went in the next morning, and uh, like I said, they had the first three of six final scenes, and I took them out in the alley behind the uh, casting offices to say them out loud. And yeah, with the third line in or something was no soup for you. And I went, oh, that's weird. Yeah, I understand for a long time you didn't want to say that famous line. Was there a reason for right. that? What changed your mind? Um, well, the reason I didn't want to say it is because I thought it was never going to sound the same as it was in context. And then almost three years later, I got asked to do the finale. And the very first thing we shot was that silent scene it, that you see when the jury is out and they're waiting for the jury to make a decision and you kind of they show you what all the you know the witnesses are up to in the town and they have me at this bed and breakfast sort of thing and i'm serving soup to poppy and poppy motions like salt and pepper and i take it away from him but they called me over and jerry just said to me we think you need to say it out loud and so i walked back across the street we did the scene one more time and I just yelled at, at Rennie, no soup for you. And I heard some chuckling behind the camera and stuff. And then they just said, check the gate. Okay, moving on. And we started to walk and Larry David be lined over to me and he goes, you know, what's funny. You say it the exact same way you said it three years ago. And from that moment on, I've said it I don't think I'm exaggerating if I say a million times. So what was it yeah, like working it was, with the cast? It was amazing. It was just, it was astounding. Um, first of all, Jason and Julia were two of the, the nicest off the bat people I'd ever met. Julia, just about every time I said something that made her laugh, she would stop and laugh and she would like take my hand and go, you're so funny. <laughs> the guy who runs the place is a little temperamental. Jerry was really nice. He's just super duper busy because he was wearing like every hat in the, you know, star, uh, producer, some time director. Sheila. Hey, uh oh, what is this? You're kissing in my line? Nobody kisses in my line. Jerry said to me, he goes, you know, man, that was really funny, but I, I just don't understand why the character has to be so mean. So he goes, can you do it again and make him like a little nicer in places? And I did all six scenes trying to make him nicer. <laughs> and crickets, you could hear crickets. I mean, nobody laughed. So I thought I wasn't going to get it. And then I got hired. And when I got to the set, Jerry walked right up to me and he goes, you know what, man, forget about the direction I gave you in the audition. Just do what you did when you walked in. It was funnier. Go figure. And so, so for a guy yeah. that powerful, you know, that was pretty cool.
<laughs> Larry Thomas, thanks for joining us. Really appreciate it. And we want to remind My our pleasure. viewers also that Seinfeld, the show about basically nothing, premieres tonight at 11.30 in the evening on CW17. And then starting September 14th, it's twice the fun with back-to-back -back shows at 11.30 and midnight. The classic lines you love and will never forget weeknights at 11.30 and midnight.